Hello everybody. Today we're gonna be giving a review on the Hoss 4x4 EXL monster truck from Traxxas. This battery does not include with the truck, but I'm just gonna use it for you. There's a light post. So truck includes this GI performance guide, which I'll teach you last time and just the right thing. Which I wanna get, but well, I don't have it yet. Don't have this video. So, instruction manual needs that. Chargers, batteries, light bulb, light bulbs, nickel metal hydride. Oh, I like that charger. But we already have a charger, so we don't need that one. Instruction guide. And color. Color. Clipless body, you can act. I don't think you can put nickel metal hydride batteries in it. That's all they show it. Just four AA batteries, which are already in the transmitter, which I'll show you quick soon. So, let's put this bag of stuff in Put it in the tea pile. It comes with a toolkit. You can open it yet. It's so many tweaks old. Shock, movies, which are kind of coming off with loose stuff in there. Okay, that's it. And before I show you the truck, I'll show you the controller. So keep it in an IKEA bag. So the controller is just your normal swap handles here. TQI, transmitter, two channels. So yeah, you can see that. But and we have to label, so, because we have three of the same controllers. So, now that the boring stuff is kind of over, or maybe some people think the boring stuff, let's look around the hall. So, suspension is pretty good, I think. Not very squishy tires compared to, like, the Rustler. Much more squishy than the Rustler. But this, and then the nice big wheelie bar. Popping wheelies, which I have popped some pretty good wheelies. This thing out of the box with the 3S lipo that's not included it does go 40 miles per hour. So, it has the clipless body thing. So, yeah, gotta get it out. Click here. Get the body. Because this bit goes. So, just the underside of the body. It's the reinforcements, which is good. We're not rolling out of these bars on top. Help it with the self riding, which it does have self riding. So, I don't know if this is double wishbone suspension. I think it is. Here's your battery connector. This tray, you're going to pop this thing out. And then you're going to put your battery in there and connect it this so that's nice um a larger motor this is the larger like the 540 xl more like like he and the rustler it's smaller and then the esc it's got the vxl 3s but with the fan and the rustler doesn't have the fan and let's check out the wheelie bars against the rustler so look Look at the rustler. Wait, well, it's much jigglier the wheelie bar the rustler than it is on the Hoss. And I just love these newer sledgehammer tires. They look pretty epic. So when you put the body on, you have to put the sides into these things. So there's the steering servo receiver box there. Flip it over. Should be able to see the receiver back here. That's not actually the receiver. That's the steering servo. The car slips out. And some towels because they're our last run. Then the Money Park, Portland Heights Park. If you live in like the uh, like area, it's the Portland Heights Park. So we have that there. So the suspension is pretty a long travel. A nice bumper. 
They don't have a lake kit yet for the horse, but they do for the rustler. I don't get why. The horse is definitely a newer truck. It's more expensive. Like 60 paying 60 more. So I'm gonna think I'm gonna set you down. Don't because set down. And maybe wait now. I don't really just gonna have to set you down for putting in the back so controller if you don't know how to set up a tractor car here is how you do it so there's a switch but I'm doing it. Okay. switch this it turns green on things on now let's take this in which is nice okay next the battery so we have to the battery here this is a four thousand milliamp with the newer connector, so. Boy, chuck in the battery. My one went to Portland Heights Park. My friend has a slash. And so his battery, wait, that's upside down. Um, holder thing for this slash, like, he, like, he lost it. So, um, Set you down here. Wait, am I flipping? Can I flip the camera? Or maybe I can just hold it. Or I think I do this, I think. Wait. Okay, you're gonna just see blackness for a little bit. Just clipping the battery real quick. Okay, there we go. Now, battery's in. Go around to the USB. There. Our truck is on, so I'm gonna have to sit you down for a tiny bit and I'll give you a spin on the porch. So, um, I can't wait. This. So, guys, um, don't worry, you're gonna see the ground for a little bit. Okay, go open the door, get out the truck, and I'll show you how to spin. So, okay, I'm grabbing entry. I might not put on the back the body so you can see it kind of. So okay. I'm trying to get it quick so I'm not actually losing the body. I'm not gonna handle it. I'm not gonna lose the body. Let's quickly get out of the house onto the porch where the truck is waiting. So, maybe if I uh, set you down. Can't see the truck light. Hmm, I could now. I could try to. Can you try to put the truck in the truck light? This is it. Wait now. If I flip it, I can't. So. See, I think you can see. You're on the oh, things fell out. So I'm gonna mount you. I'm gonna move forward. Oh. Mm. You are now aboard a hot. Mm-hmm. 
but I think I don't know. Maybe this roof that gets that's kind of blurry because I can see it. Total beast. I'm just gonna throw my phone in my phone. Um, I don't know, but I think this is gonna be the end of the review because I can't really get a very good view. this review it's actually took a longer than expected well, let me see actually but um this is the hoss i mean you didn't get a very good view of board, but kind of, with the unborn i couldn't really like do couldn't like drive with it in my hand the phone so I didn't, I forgot to get the, tri I don't even know where our tripod is. So um, I'm sorry about that, but hopefully you had a good time learning about the truck. I'm just seeing how capable, well, you didn't really see how capable it is when you have all this grassland and stuff. But you could drive through, but I didn't really want to because I didn't have any shoes on. So, um... That's going to be the end of this video. And again, thank you for watching.
hope you like the hoss. If you don't already have a hoss, I would suggest getting one. And yeah, that's it. Bye.